All-Star game is tonight. Let's go this time to Brad in Detroit, the site of tonight's All-Star game. Hey, Brad, how are you? Hey, Rome, what's up there, guy? What's up, Brad? How you doing? Oh, I'm pretty good. I just want to chime in because I heard you talking about uh, Cal Ripken and his uh, stupid overrated record. And I would fast forward five years of my life just so I can see Hideki Matsui break his record and I can hear all the little babies in Baltimore cry about it, how it's unfair because Champions League games don't count. I can Ripken sucks. He's overrated. He was overpaid. He did nothing good. He's average player at best who had a crappy record because he didn't play that hard. And so everybody thinks he's so great. Wow, he played a bunch of games in a row. Good job there, tough guy. I would pay a million dollars just so I could spray that guy in the face of a full mace spray. I okay, that, that's about enough, Brad. All right? If you had a million dollars to spend, I might listen to a little more of that. I can almost get beyond the, quote, Cal Ripken sucks blast. Cal Ripken won the MVP award twice. He won a World Series. He's a 19-time All-Star, a first ballot Hall of Famer who played in more than 2,600 consecutive games. He does not suck. That's really not just my opinion. That's a fact. He does not suck. The record is not stupid. The record is not overrated. And you don't have a million bucks to pay to spray him in the face with mace. Why you'd want to, I really have no idea. He represents what's right with the game, not what's wrong with the game. But I don't think there's any disputing this point. 19 All-Star games, more than 400 home runs, more than 3,000 base knocks. He revolutionized the position. A two-time MVP -er and a world champion and a first ballot Hall of Famer. He does not suck. You're just wrong. He doesn't suck. Now, if you want to come in here and say, I don't know, Alex Cora sucks, he Sop Choi sucks, I'll entertain that discussion. I advocate that you not want to spray them in the face with mace. I mean, who else sucks as long as we're having this conversation? Does Ted Williams suck? Does Mickey Mantle suck? Do you want to dig up Babe Ruth so you can spray him in the face with mace? Does Barry Bonds suck? Michael Jordan's the worst basketball player ever. Saying that you'll pay a million dollars to spray that guy in the face with mace ranks right up there with that caller who says he wants to fight Barry Bonds. If he saw him on the street, he'd fight him, is what one caller once said. You can say what you want about that record. You can say what you want about whether or not Cal should have been out there. But you can't tell me Cal Ripken sucks because that's just a stupid take. That's just ignorant. That's just wrong. And no, I don't happen to think that that record is, quote, stupid and overrated. And why you'd want to spray a guy in the face with Mace, who pretty much has been credited with saving the sport, I really don't know. All right, I'm going to come right back. Guys who go to 19 All-Star games do not suck. I know that. I may not know everything. I might not really even know that much at all, but I know this. Cal Ripken did not suck. I'm pretty firm in my conviction in saying that. All right, we're going to come back. Billy Ripken, different story. Billy, maybe. Cal, no. Bernard Hopkins, tomorrow. By no measuring stick, mine, yours, or anybody else's, does Cal Ripken, quote, suck. No. Stay tuned. You're listening to The Jim Rome Show.